All right, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Akeem and welcome to this vlog. I'm here to give you another preview in the American Athletic Conference for the 2015 college football season. For this vlog, I'm here to talk about the Memphis Tigers. They had a great year last season going 10-3 and overall and their head coach John Fuentes, who is actually coach of the year of the American Athletic Conference, did a brilliant job helping this team win at least a share of the conference championship. Now this year, Year. They do have a couple of key starters returning offensively, but they do have a couple of players missing defensively. Now, starting with the offensive side, um, Paxton Lynch, their star quarterback, their, their great quarterback, who had 22 touchdown passes and nine interceptions last season, and 13 rushing touchdowns total last year as well. He definitely, he's been doing well, especially in goal line situations and sneaking the ball in and giving you a couple of rushing touchdowns. Now he is actually going to have one of his top receivers returning, a couple of his top receivers, and Moses on um, Frazier, as well as first team All American Conference tight end Allen Cross. Now as far as the backfield he's actually gonna have to play without the running back on Brandon Hayes he's actually no longer with the team he was a senior last year and they do have Jarvis Cooper who is a fine replacement he did average five yards per carry last season and I think he's also going to be split in time with the Roland Darcius I think these two players could be a decent on one two tandem in the backfield for the Tigers offense now as far as the defensive unit they actually only allowed 19 and a half points per game and they had two good players on the defensive side who was first team all honors and for their efforts starting with defensive lineman and Martin Effiti he's no longer with the team as long as with his teammate and Tank Jakes, who was actually the defensive player of the year, co-defensive player of the year of the uh, All American uh, of the American Conference, uh, American Athletic Conference last season. So three players in particular that I'm looking at as far as impact players this year are Jannard uh, Avery, Dylan Jackson, and Ricky Hunter in that defensive line for the Tigers to step it up this year. They do have um, at least four sacks each last season. Now, as far as their incoming freshmen, they did have three. Um, a couple, many three-star recruits. Start with running back in um, um, Jamarius Anderson, who's from Midland City, um, Alabama. They picked up a Louisiana native and Joseph Pro Prevost, the outside linebacker, and they did, did pick up Tony on um, Pollard as well to help add addition and more depth in the line for um, this. Uh, their uh, offensive line for their team. I think they did had a couple of decent pickups. They're still not getting any big name recruits, but they're doing enough job to help solidify uh, good slots in the, their teams and win, win at least a, sh a, a, a conference championship and get be on the hunt for a conference championship. Now, looking at their schedule, they have a pretty favorable schedule this year. The only two teams I'm looking at that they have concerns, actually three teams, um, Houston, Ole Miss in, that, in the middle of their season as well as Cincinnati. Now I do believe that they're going to have at least two losses in that in those matches so I think their team is going to go 10-2 and two overall but I still have them winning the American Athletic Championship this season. I think they're going to be due for a good year and I think they have they will beat Cincinnati in that head-to-head -head matchup and because of that I have to give them the edge to win the um, American Conference the title and I have them being the, t uh, the champions this season. Now the next time to catch you guys will be in just a couple of minutes. I have seven more blogs for today. Thank you for watching this blog. I'm Manikeem Call. Be easy.